Hi, my name is Julia, and I work on the uh, plastics team at RIT. And we're a really interdisciplinary team, so my background is in uh, applied math, but we have chemists, uh, biochemists, and ecologists on the team. And we're all uh, studying different aspects of what happens to plastic when it uh, enters large bodies of water. So plastic pollution is an issue that really has gotten a lot of attention recently. Um, Starbucks was pressured into selling the sippy cup lids and removing the straws. So it's really an issue that a lot of people talk about. But there's a lot of uh, things that aren't understood about it. So we have been aging plastics um, on rafts in different locations around the Rochester area, like uh, Canisius Lake, Lake Ontario, um, and j -Lot Pond on campus. Um, and we're, our team is investigating what kind of changes happen to these plastics after they've been exposed to the elements for a long period of time. So these samples here, so beautiful, have been in the water for uh, four months. And we're processing the samples today. And we're uh, hoping to learn more about what changes happen to the plastic. And this is. Um, this gives us a better idea of how the plastic behaves in the water, how plastic pollution behaves, and also what impacts it can have to uh, the ecosystem in the water. Hi, my name is Raquel Diaz. I'm an undergraduate environmental science major here at RIT, and I'm part of the biotribution subgroup on the microplastics team. We're specifically interested in how the reworking and movement of the benthic worm Lumbriculus veridatus affects the position and or burial of microplastics in freshwater systems. My name is Carmela. I'm a BSMS student with the environmental science department. Um, for the plastic project, I'm working on the metagenomic set of things, so specifically categorizing bacterial community on our plastic cameras across various freshwater sites. My name is Raymond Malinowski, and I'm in the Microplastics Project. I explore the fate of microplastics in wetland ecosystems as they travel through the sediment and even in invertebrates. I'm also researching the uh, effects on decomposition rates through a litter bag experiment that might go into Toronto. We'll end up seeing. Hi, I'm Christina. I'm a graduate student in the Environmental Sciences program. And through the Plastics Project, I work with Dr. Christy Tyler in examining the acute and chronic ecotoxicity of multiple polymers on the benthic ecosystem engineer Lumbriculus variegatus. Um, and afterwards, I look at how plastics have unique impacts on ecosystem function, um, looking at dissolved oxygen flux, nutrient flux, as well as other sediment characteristics like nitrogen removal, and changes in organic matter. And my name is Nick Schneider. I'm a third year chemistry major. My part of this project is working on developing methods for the extraction of microplastics from wetland samples. And so with that, I'd just like to say on behalf of the whole team, thank you for watching.